three, two, one. We're gonna win this thing. Hip, hip. I can feel your excitement. <laughs> Hilarious. You should go into comedy. I did. I'm good at this. It is officially award season, and with the Golden Globes happening today, we're taking a look at some of the films nominated that premiered right here at home. Can we ask why? Has something changed? No. No, it hasn't changed, or no, we can't ask. Kicking it off with Knives Out, a star-studded ensemble film that puts a spotlight on the mysterious death of a crime novelist just after his 85th birthday. Knives Out is nominated in the Best Musical or Comedy category tonight, but it is a thrilling film that keeps you laughing while you're perched on the edge of your seat. Whatever it takes, I'm ready to do it. Also nominated in the best musical or comedy category, Dolomite is my name. Eddie Murphy making a roaring return to film with his role as Rudy Ray Moore, a real-life comedy and rap pioneer who creates an alter ego and becomes the star of a kung fu anti-establishment movie. Dolomite is my name marks Murphy's first film in three years and his first R-rated movie since 1999. Murphy is also up for a globe tonight in the category of best actor in a musical or comedy film. He is one of seven people of color nominated out of about 120 nominees this year. His master Joshua, you're a top man. Prepare to leave the house. Rounding out our top three TIFF premiere hits nominated for a globe, the polarizing dramedy Jojo Rabbit. The film follows a young boy living in Nazi Germany at the tail end of World War II when he discovers his mother, played by Scarlett Johansson, is sheltering a young Jewish girl in their attic. While the boy wrestles with his beliefs, he is confronted by his imaginary friend, Adolf Hitler. Director Taika Waititi's Jojo Rabbit also nabbed the top prize of movie buffs at TIFF, taking home the Grolsch People's Choice Award. For City News, I'm Quinton Bignall.